tragic end to the search for a car that fell from the ferry to Fisher Island. That car, two women, and two women have been found under the water. CBS 4's Rio Creighton is live at the Coast Guard Station in Miami Beach with the overnight developments. Rio? Miami-Dade Fire Rescue found that car with those two women unresponsive inside, submerged in the water. Uh, this happening after 10.30 last night. They worked to get those women in their car out of the water. Sadly, now Miami-Dade police are reporting those women are dead. This is video that was taken a, just short, a short time ago as that vehicle was being towed away from the Coast Guard station here this morning. Chopper 4 flew over government cut at around 5 o'clock yesterday afternoon as they heard that a car on a ferry had fallen off with people inside. Rescue divers had been in the water for hours, air rescue above, helping in the surge. According to investigators, the operator of a ferry that was transporting vehicles from Fisher Island reported that a vehicle had fallen overboard. A multi-agency search for the vehicle was initiated by divers from Miami-Dade Fire Rescue and Miami-Dade Police. Divers located that vehicle submerged in the area of government cut near Fisher Island. The vehicle was recovered from the water and investigators discovered those two women dead inside. For those who are not familiar with the, the area, the, you know that the only way to get to Fisher Island is by boat or or by putting your car on a ferry. The United States Coast Guard now says it's going to be conducting a maritime incident investigation. Miami Day police say they will be conducting a death investigation. We're live in Miami Beach, Riel Creighton, CBS 4 this morning.